Good morning, fellow wet shavers. It is Monday, start of the week. I'm Brian and welcome to the Wet Shave Experience. Today I will be using a sample of Moon Soap's Havana that I got from a buddy of mine, Josh. I do not have the splash, so I'm gonna pair it with the Declaration Grooming Massacre of the Innocents. Um, scent is different, but this does have uh, some tobacco and vanilla in it, so they both share that. I will be using my uh, disassembled at this point carve this is a three piece razor and then I'm gonna do uh, I got a sample pack of blades a long time ago and I haven't gone through them all so I'm just gonna try this Derby premium blade in the razor today see how that works in the carve I also just pulled this out I, I had an old top cap but you can see that this is the top cap I've been using this is a uh, one that hasn't been used as much and it's starting to get a lot of good patina on this one I've been using quite a bit. So let's load the blade. Hope everybody had a good weekend. All right. And there's our blade. No uh, annoying adhesive on it that I can detect. So we'll just throw it in there. And so this is Moon Soaps Week, uh, Can Shave Through 326. Give a shout out for Moon Soaps Week this week, so I'm doing my part to participate. Uh, this is the first time I've used this sample, and I've had it quite a while. Uh, I guess I've just been using other stuff and kind of had forgotten about it for a while, and I thought what better time to break it out than today. All right, let's get started with the fancy mister. Still kind of getting used to this thing. You know, I put hot water in here, but still miss kind of cool water. It's not cold, but cool. And uh, for a brush, I'll be using the PAA Starcraft. And we're all lathered in the bowl here. I did lather this myself this morning. Uh, the, lather seems to, the lather seems to be fairly creamy. Smells really good. Scent notes on this, actually. I have tobacco, bergamot, vetiver, spice, musk, warm vanilla, and aged teak wood, I think. So definitely a different scent than the Declaration. The Declaration has a cinnamon in it. Uh, it has cedar in it. So some different kind of woods. This is definitely more tobacco forward, um, but I actually quite like this one. It's very nice. I'm working on two days growth. I shaved Saturday. I did not shave yesterday. I took the day off. Hope everybody had a good weekend. We did our family photos on Saturday. That was an event, it's fun. A three and a five year old are not the easiest to do photo shoots with, but they did pretty darn good. I had to bribe them with a little bit of candy, which seemed to work. And then our 16 year old, you know how 16 year olds are, they can, <laughs> whether they're there or not, they, there's other things they'd rather be doing. So between the three of them, it was fun, but we got it done. And actually, I think we got some nice photos out of it. All right. I think that's pretty good. So, so let's get started. We'll try the Derby Blade. Seems to work okay. We'll see. The only blade I've so far tried in this that I haven't liked in this razor. I've tried the Astro Blue and the Astro Green. And for some reason, I don't know, I just 
I didn't care for those blades in the carve anyways. So residual slickness is fairly good. I can go back over the same areas again and without any drag. And the razor still glides a little bit. Okay, first pass done. Trying to concentrate a little bit more on my technique. Kind of had a bit of a rough shave on Saturday. I did a tribute shave with my favorite soap and stuff with my son, but, and I know it wasn't the soap, but I think just <laughs> as it was really fun and those moments with my son are definitely precious, but I think my lathering and it was really thin and just I would think I went to it was in hasty in my shave and I got down and my skin felt really irritated especially on my neck so anyways I've used the soap and splash it multiple times so I know it's not from that so just just a bit of a rough shave so I normally don't shave on sun, Sunday, Saturdays or Sundays, really, but nice break yesterday for my skin. Yesterday was quite busy. Took the kids to the BMX track. My daughter did great. She's a five and under novice. She's five and a half. She got her fourth win on Saturday. So she got a nice, cool little first place trophy. You see the cream on there. And then my son's doing Strider. He's three and a half. He took first also. So. They both got little trophies, so fun day. Although it was kind of long, we were running late at the track. No, really. This blade seems to be doing pretty good. And this is a chromium, ceramic, platinum, tungsten, and polymer coated edge. That's a lot of words. But it seems to be doing all right. Kind of wait to reserve judgment until everything is all done. Let's we'll see how efficient it was. I'm really enjoying the soap. The scent is really nice. I know this was 
Ken's top. He did his top five moon soaps, and they only have five right now, but he did his top five, and this was his number one, actually. And it is really, really a nice scent. The tobacco is definitely there, but it's not overpowering. It's not too strong. The sweetness of the vanilla is there in the background. It's really nice. Not too musky. It's really just well blended. Quite enjoying it. Nice light touch on the third pass. Yeah, just falling on there like a pillow. Seemed to take enough water. I didn't put too much. I was afraid to, I wasn't sure how much it would take since this was the first time I've lathered it. I didn't do a test lather because I only had a sample. I have not tried any other Moon Soaps products yet. <laughs> I'm just going to do a little cleanup on the neck. No weird growth areas. No, I don't follow the traditional exact. I don't do a cross much on my neck or I'm out of order. But hey, it's your shave. Do what you want, right? Just found that my sequence and process works for me and that's what matters. Yeah, that's good. I'm gonna I just have a tough time going against the grain on my mustache area. I'm fine that I just don't need to. So we're not gonna worry about it today. All right, let's rinse this off. Got the cold water on there. And the water's starting to get cold. I think it got like to down, it's supposed to, it was supposed to have get, gotten down to 27 degrees here last night. It's just cold for us. But there's no precipitation out there, so we didn't, we didn't get any snow. But the rain has started. Got lucky it didn't rain yesterday at the BMX track though. It's actually, Cold but sunny. All right. Let's this on. Oh, this splash just has a nice feel. Definitely a difference in the scent. I can get the tobacco on the declaration, but the cinnamon and the cedar are there, so it's not quite as um, not quite the same as the Havana. But anyways, they pair well enough together. Thanks for watching. Hope everybody has a good week and we'll see you later. And oh, and by the way, if you enjoyed watching, subscribe below. I'd appreciate it. All right.